Badminton DJ, baby! And guess what day it is? It seems for Build Monday, baby! Woo! It feels like it's been a bit since I got into the building world, but it's only because I had a few videos prepped. So let's get into this. Let's build something beautiful. I'm wearing my red shirt today because I'm in the vibe for building something in the red scheme. And of course, hit that like button, subscribe, subscribe if you're new for all that beautiful Sims content we bring to you on this wonderful gaming channel. And of course, base game required because that's what I like to do. Since I've expanded into the whole uh, building scene we want to make sure that we are using base game stuff so i get used to all the stuff because you know when you do cc and all this other fun packs maybe not everybody has it so base game is the best game so let's get over into our building section i don't even know where i want to build today my game locked me into here so i feel like we're gonna go into the cliff side crescent and click build Let's do it. Why not? This is going to be a good place to build, I think. We are set, ready to go. I feel like as... Oh, it's so pretty here, actually. Hello. And I was like, this is regular game, and this is my beautiful light. So I was like, oh, it's so pretty. But I just thought of something. I was like, I have to get used to how all these controls work again. So front of the house, of course, has beautiful vibes. We got nice greeneries. And cacti over here and some gorgeous houses. This is my can you see my house I built? No. I have a not maybe the best house, but I have a really cool house here that my vampire um series with the paranormal pack was on. But let's get into it. Let's have some fun. I really oh there's a cute little bench here for a viewing pleasure. Too bad you couldn't like connect. Like right here, I want to be able to connect and like make that like a little pathway from my house. But why nobody's gonna be doing that for us because that is just how the game goes all right so here's my let's get back to the front here we want to have a nice little pathway here i think we're gonna have a door how tall i gotta figure out how tall these guys are Doo -doo -doo. but it's okay we're not going crazy i have like a nice little entrance I feel like I'm missing controls that I'm normally doing on my keyboard, but hey. And then, let's say, right here. Be the little entrance. And then we'll have a little bathroom here. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that right? I want to attach the bathroom, <laughs> but yes, that's right. And then we will have kitchen, living room. I always got to do those small houses, you know, that is how it works for me. And then we'll have our bedroom here. Boom! Oh, we got ourselves a house, right? We got ourselves a house because we are what in Sims 3 camera mode. Perfect. Walls are up. What height of the walls are we? That is in half wall. Yeah, we're like, I'm like, ooh, we're using very tall walls. Medium walls are good for me, I think. I think that's how I want to play it. And then, let's see. We do need to get rid of this wall because not really boom, doing us any good. Now let's get our roof. And we want to go probably afternoon, evening. Evening's not bad of a view. Let's try evening, actually. Evening looks good. So actually, no, it's perfect that we're doing um in the um act space game. It's perfect that we are doing the lovely um I feel like there's something I'm supposed to do with my controls I haven't done in such a long time. Not. Oh, that's a picture taken. Because I just feel like there's like all these like stuff I'm so used to doing with my keyboard, but I haven't done it in such a long time. I'm probably just going crazy, but that is fine. So where are we? There's my front. And we do want to have a front. Actually, you know what? 
No, this is good. I like this little side porch for some reason, but we're gonna do a door right there. So we got base game activated. We're gonna get a nice door. Let's see. What do we got that I'm um, screaming vibes? You get a black door from you. I still I don't want blue in this. You're not gonna let me place a door. Doors. That's weird. I can't place any doors. Very strange. Can I place you? I can't place you. How do you build and not place a door? Will you let me place windows? No. Why can't I place windows? Well, that's silly. We're gonna have to figure this out. Alright, we are back, and as you can see, we have doors again. I don't know what the complete cause was. It's definitely one of my mods. So I updated a few of them, but I've not allowed mods to be activated at this moment because I'd like to just get this build going and get things started because I want to build a house. So let's go and exit out of what I was doing here. And let's get back into filters, baby. Packs, base game. And I really just wanted like a black door. I want to see. And let's put my walls back up. Cause like, why would I want, I can do a taller door, but taller doors, what do they look like? The action, fire the taller level, oh, okay, perfect. I was like, why can't I use a taller door? And how short is a short door then? Oh, wow, that's what, no, I'm gonna use medium height door then. And I want, I like these doors actually. What does the black variant of this one looks like? Oh, with lots of light, yes. Do I want a sideways entrance then? I kind of do. I don't know why. I feel like that would be really fun. But let's go back on top and get the roof going, baby. Let's get me a roof. We all know how great I am at roofs. I am, like, amazing at them. Jokes! Ha ha ha. So how do we want to do this? Is it this? How did I... I feel like there's something I'm missing. But maybe not. I don't. I feel like there's something with the controls. It's been so long since I've had to build anything. I'm just getting all messed up. Okay, I like that. Obviously, it's very simple. But I feel like I should be able to... See, rotate. Ah. <sighs> There you go. Those are one of my controls. <laughs> okay, okay. Anyways, we're gonna go here. We're gonna put you there. And I gotta figure out how and what we're doing with this. Like, how do you make a roof there? Alright, so. I took some time and played with the roof. I'm not super happy with it, but I think that's one thing I'll have to start practicing on my own. Again and again, more roof tactics. So I can kind of clear out something like that. The back side, what I do, I don't mind it, but I might have to actually just bring this guy in one, just to fix that. Yeah, that's okay. And I actually don't mind this porch style thing I kind of got going on, ish. Something simple like that. Perfect. And then we'll just decorate around it. That's what we're going to do. We will decorate around that beauty, though. Let's get some windows in here. Now that we can place a windows, base game, a good to go. I like, because where, where are we? Let me just double check something. Here. This is our living room. Got nice, bright windows in our living room. It's not red. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so where do we want them? There. That's our bathroom. Do we have something similar to these windows? So what are these? 
not so much. These are the only types of guys which I actually quite like these windows with. They are quite nice. So put those there. And then I guess that was my so that's the entrance, bathroom, and then kitchen and living. This would be my bedroom. The bedroom. Do we got any more larger than life style windows that can do this red? Yes we do. So I'll have to put another um That's good like that. Let's get our wall tool, baby. So I'll put our wall tool up here. Gotta figure out, this is basically gonna come up here. Like so. I would say that's nice. Might extend that out just a smidgen, but it's actually quite a, maybe I'll just do this. Wait, room. There, that's better. That's a good size room. And then our living room section. I actually like these windows very nice. They're gonna do well. I think that concept just back and forth, they can't tell. And then one there, and one there. Beautiful wallpaper for the outside, baby. Do we want. Oh, actually. No, I was gonna say, do we want that? Yeah, we do, but we can't, because it's not base game. What does bricks look like in there? Is that gonna be too much? But I want a little bit of a different. Oh, no, not that. I won't. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Do you have a black trim then? Dad, no, you don't. You stick to that. I kind of. Do I want red bricks and red? No, I want black. I like this. Yeah, that looks good. Then let's just go up a floor just to make sure. Oh. Are you gonna let me hit you or not? There we go. There. Cute. It's a little bit on the darker side, which I actually like for whatever reason. It's beautiful. Let's get ourselves some nice red brick. Jingles, baby, let's go. Cool. More of a red tone. But that works, right? And then maybe we want. Yeah, see, those windows look good there, but they don't look good on this part. So we're gonna just bluster you down. Yeah. Or there. I like this. I like it. And because we're in the desert, we're gonna have to make sure we are sticking to more like these types of styles. What do these guys look like nice and big? Now, am I also when I do my houses, I do them like affordable for like brand new sims moving in but i'm not in the mood for that i'm in the mood for decorating and doing as i please i'm not gonna do too crazy expensive stuff for the santa of the house inside baby but i just kind of want to do a little bit of hey hey and i am going to get the sand tool out here oh that's what i call it just to kind of you know, instead of like dirt that I would normally probably do around these areas, I'm gonna do um, a little bit of the sand because you know we are in the desert, baby. Mainly um, because I am growing and learning, and this is how we do it. We slowly like do a little bit more each time we play this game to get better and better and better. Probably need you. I'm also going to. Trash can. 
I thought it worked perfectly there. So I like my little cute little house, my little um, black and red theme on the outside. So we're gonna go now into the inside, finally. Yeah. And we're going to build, baby. We got our um, light in place. And now we're just going to get some lighting <laughs> in the ceiling. Make sure it's still um, keeping my base game filters on the floor. I don't want to miss that kind of stuff up. We want my ceiling lights. These beautiful guys that create the best light possible. This, I'm realizing, is a gigantic bathroom. Lucky us. It's always fun when you have a nice bigger area to utilize. Okay, that's enough light in my mind. Now, we got our entranceway. I'm kind of wanting to keep everything very similar in the flooring sense. Flooring? No, it's not. Yeah, this is fine. How is this flooring? Oh, interesting. I kind of like this concept, but what is that? Brick and... I like this concept for the entrance. I do. And I like it for the bathroom. This is not... This is what I want for the bathroom. This is what I want for... The, in my mind, I feel like it's kind of like this natural brick that they've done throughout the entire house. So it's very um, like brick, concrete, you know, that kind of Mediterranean style vibes. So we're gonna do, you know, terracotta, like nothing too crazy. I don't know how red does this look. Very red. Or they can do like an accent. Oh, oh. do this wall. Like an accent wall of it here. And here. And then, do we have a little bit more of a neutral palette? Oh, it's so red. That's kind of what I wanted to do, but maybe not now. That brick doesn't really suit everything. This is more of an outdoor. Let's get back into <laughs> something that's going to be a little but more mellowed down to what I'm looking for. Something like this. Normally I would just pick stick with a color, but some of these colors are just... Red is a very strong color, as we can clearly see in here. I need something that's not too, too red. Or do I do like accent walls like this? Right? And then do the red. I did say I want to do red. I kind of like all of that. Now, with an accent of red in here. I like our vibey little kitchen area, I think. It's going to be really cute. With the red like that. There we go. Hello. Hello, house. We're getting there. We're getting there. Yeah, we're good. Put out the walls just to double check. Everything is beautiful and fabulous. All right. Okay, let's start styling our little bedroom. Let's go into the bedroom here. All right, I have finally finished the inside. Normally I like to do it while I go, but I want to put some more thought and energy into this one because I haven't done a lot of like detailed stuff and I still don't think this is what you would consider detailed but I like all the stuff I put in it I love the outside it really kind of interacts well with my little cactus here against the scenery that's here so you just have a little awning out here and then I haven't done a lot of builds where I work on the backyard so I figured I'd leave the backyard as is 
and just kind of go from there. But if we go deep down to the main level, as you can see, our beautiful lit entrance here with our gorgeous door. A little entryway here. I thought that'd be kind of fun to do. We got our wonderful spot to put our hat, jacket, our keys on top. Check ourselves in the mirror before we go out. And of course, a little bench to put your shoes on. And then that entrance walks yourself into the kitchen. The living room combo, baby. Oh, it's gorgeous. Let me just... Pop that down for just two seconds. Look in here. I love it. So we got, I was kind of like country, rustic, a lot of like, originally like I was saying I wanted to do red, but then like it kind of turned into like red with some black and brown accents. So I really enjoy the little cactus and ferns we got going on here in the kitchen. It is beautiful. So we have our lovely um, pancakes picture. I don't know why I felt like I really needed to put this in the video. And then we got a little reading nook in the back here, which is amazing. And then we lead you into a little, this was actually what I thought was gonna be my dining area here. But then I ended up putting it into my little kitchen cove, which I thought was nice. Cause if you're in here cooking and prepping dinner, when we do develop the backyard, you have a lot of um, stuff to kind of set yourself going. And then we got our wonderful kitchen table. I really wanted to focus on some of the new products that have come from um, the custom content creators that got put into the base game. And then of course, lead off into the back here, which is your beautiful bathroom, set with gorgeous browns, woods, natural, and a gorgeous tub and a shower, baby, because you know, you gotta have both when you're living in a luxury. And then you go into our little bedroom here at the end, Gorgeous artwork on the wall, kind of did something different. I haven't really played a lot with artwork. I just kind of put the basics, because it's a base game, you know, because if we go to upload this on, um, save this lot here, how much is it? 42,000. So I don't normally spend that much money. I usually am doing like a $19,000 house. So, and of course, can't forget another art studio there and another mirror to make this room look even bigger. Like, look how great that looks in the mirror. So, I'm really excited how this looks, of course. I hope you are too. So, as we continue to grow, I know we're getting like quite over a dozen of um, our little builds here, but I'm still learning. I feel like I'm getting the touch of adding a little bit more clutter, which I really am appreciating. Like, the rooms feel full, which I thought that's why I wanted to spend a little bit more extra money in this game. For this one but yeah so hit that like button subscribe, subscribe if you're new and catch more baby sims videos from ernie j we'll be on the next one <laughs> <laughs>